Great to have you with us. I'm Joe Donlin. And I'm Marie Saavedra. Right now at five, more questions than answers. After a woman was found dead in a restricted area at O'Hare. Chicago police are now investigating how she got into the area. Suzanne Lemonio joins us now live from O'Hare with some new information tonight. Suzanne. Joe Marie, this happened right here at Terminal 5. This is the international terminal. What we're learning, the woman was trapped in the conveyor belt of a piece of machinery here. Now, this 57-year-old woman was in an area that at Terminal 5, the public cannot access. Police say when reviewing video, she was seen entering an unoccupied restricted area at 227 this morning. The fire department was called around 745 a.m when the woman was found trapped in the conveyor belt on a piece of equipment that's used to move baggage. How she got there still isn't known. Fire department personnel at O'Hare found the woman unresponsive. The exact time when she got into the machinery still also not known. She was pronounced dead at the scene. Now we've checked with the Occupational Safety and Health Administration or OSHA and they told us they're not investigating because the woman is not an airport employee. We've also been asking if the death investigation affected passengers getting on or off planes today, but so far the Department of Aviation has not gotten back to us. An autopsy is going to be performed on the woman tomorrow. Again, still so many unanswered questions as to how this woman got in that area. At O'Hare, Suzanne Lemonio, CBS News, Chicago. Thanks, Suzanne.